Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, this is going to be a light racket video. It's going to be a light day, hopefully. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so hoping that it's a light day. It's a little overcast out there. It's time to drink my black coffee, guys. If you want to support the channel, support my dark roast habit, network is buy me a coffee, forward slash, tennis spin. Thank you in advance, and thank you for everybody who supported my caffeine dark roast habit. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about light rackets. Okay, I've done a video like this before, but there's been some revisions in the market. Um, as we all know, rackets change, name changes, color changes. So I I love that Babolat G Lite before, and I know a bunch of you are contacting me saying, they don't make that racket, I can't get that racket anymore. So that G Lite, oh, hey! What's up, Eduardo? Oh, it's my man from uh, the eyeglass place. Hi, right. how's it going, everybody? You got some, <laughs> some important stuff there. Thank you. All right. Me. So that's my, my man, uh, Johnny from uh, Next Door. He does uh, um, eyeglass fittings and prescriptions for uh, your vision. We're great neighbors. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, so let's talk about light, light rackets here. G light, no longer made. Everybody's asking me um what what they should get so in this video i'm going to actually do a revision on light rackets because the market has changed okay but not that much but not that much uh, i'm going to tell you my four favorite light rackets now that's pretty much accessible to everyone okay so i'm actually going to start with um artengo which i feel is pretty accessible throughout the world um this is not the one though i don't i'm sold out of the t30 light so i like that racket a lot especially for the price point and the quality so if you have to have a light racket that's a great players young players stick or if you just want a light racket Get the 930 light, okay? Um, as I said, I'm sold out of it. Um, hopefully the world isn't sold out of it. Uh, and hopefully they have it at the Artango store, your local Artango store, the Cathalon store, excuse me, or online. Um, super popular in zero grip, one, one grip and, and four and a quarters. So for the people who are kind of smaller, have smaller hands, um, this, this would be your racket in most countries because the Cathlon stores are pretty much worldwide. Okay, so TR930 light though, light. Okay, it's it's my go-to for people who just want a light racket at that kind of a price point. Okay, so so my favorite my favorite light racket on the mainstream line that's in pro shop specialty is the extreme light so again i'm sold out of it i don't know when i'm going to get more this is unfortunately the tour version so i'm going to cover up the tour um, great all-around stick slightly oversized nice and light for anyone who wants a light racket to play with this whole extreme line has been my favorite of all time in the headline because it kind of suits i would say 70 to 80 percent of the population easy to play with um, decent power and of course my favorite feel there's a lot of feel in these rackets so it's all about feeling you know so and who doesn't like this gray and this fluorescent yellow i mean it's it's definitely a fan favorite at least with me Okay, so extreme light, my favorite mainstream light racket. Like if you're a beginner, a lot of you women contact me saying, oh, G light's gone. Try this one. For those of you who have to have Babolat because they have superstar status, 
you can go banana banana yellow in the light which will generate a ton of spin and the most spin out of this whole list of light rackets um, or you can go with a little more plow in the pure drive both of these will be great choices both of these are the industry leaders in light rackets i saw a ton of these i saw a ton of these to 12 13 year olds 14 year olds a lot of women or, or people who just want a light racket so i've seen six foot two guys that use light rackets um there's nothing i can say to convince them otherwise but you know it is what it is okay so more spin the most spin in the category banana yellows so spinning bananas okay plowing blue blue plow okay if you want a little more plow go for the pure drive light okay now the racket of choice evo drive light is the one that replaced g light okay it's the new g the gatorade okay no more g it's e vote light so the head got a little bigger though it's a 104 just as stiff just as much feel I've probably sold hundreds of these this year. I've had to wait two months for these. They're finally back. So they've done extremely well with this racket. I am not sure how long they will keep this name or this color, but as long as these are out and you are wanting a super light racket at a semi affordable price, or if you're a 12 year old, 13 year old getting your first adult racket, you get this racket in a zero grip, possibly a one grip, depending on how tall you are, um, and you are set for a while. So this is the new G Lite. Um, for those of you who, who've, uh, I am me, this is it, guys, Evo Lite. But all of these rackets are wonderful. Um, this is the one that's kind of like the perfect price point that's strong and ready to go. If you really wanted to spend a little extra and go for these, definitely do it. If you can get, if you can find an extreme light uh, in your grip size, definitely do it. If you live in a country that has Artango from those decathlon stores, um, definitely get this one because this is definitely going to be that take and go racket. You know, like Panda Express, you know, you kind of like point to the one you want, you know, take and go, go eat, right? Go play. All right, guys, I hope this helped. Light rackets on a dark day in my dark coffee habit. Ah, what more can you want? Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Did it at the shop. Okay.